Ahmed Issa is a radio talk show host in Nigeria's capital city. He's been in the broadcast business for over 20 years. He runs an unusual program. Every weekday, people come to this radio station with their complaints and problems. Usually, it's packed full. Many have exhausted all avenues of seeking redress. They see this studio as their last resort. And the presenter, an avatar. Make government do what they're supposed to do. All they need is one chance to tell their story. Like this man on a wheelchair, his story stirred up emotions. He used to be a police surgeon. He claims he was kicked out of work after being involved in an accident which paralyzed him and claimed the lives of three other colleagues. Here's another case of a woman who says she was stabbed by her neighbor. She claims he was giving her two-year-old daughter alcohol and her attempt to stop him backfired. Over the years, Ahmed's radio show has gained a lot of popularity. He says he has lived his life fighting other people's battles and giving a voice to the voiceless is what drives him to do what he does. No salary, no allowance. But I am enjoying what I am doing. Helping people is what gives me joy in my life. Ahmed's presentation style is quite unconventional. And several times he has run into trouble with the authorities. But he says it's the only way he can make an impact. We have bad leadership. I'm not saying that we don't have a few good leaders. But the majority of them are terrible leaders. Prick their conscience or consciences. I'm not a coward. For Ahmed, he may be an ordinary man, but he's bent on taking extraordinary measures to make an impact in his generation. He says he lives every day giving people hope and wouldn't trade that for any other. Kelechi Emekalam, TVC News, Abuja.